Mother Nature sure is dramatic. Today we're doing the top 5 most enormous avalanches ever seen. Number 5. A colossal avalanche is set off on the Stevens Pass Mountain in Washington to help mitigate the risk of natural avalanches hitting skiers. A 50-pound bomb was dropped from a helicopter directly onto the top of the weak snow. The size of the avalanche here is the largest ever seen at the Stevens Pass Ski Resort. Just watch how the trees get thrown forward like sticks, a testament to how immensely powerful avalanches can be. Mount Rainer is the largest mountain in the state of Washington. In 2006, a massive avalanche occurred that streamed down the entire mountain. The avalanche initially caved off from an ice cliff located much further up the mountain. On this day, thankfully, no one was in harm's way. But Mount Rainer has a notorious history of large avalanches. Back in 1981, 11 climbers were killed by an enormous avalanche as they were ascending the mountain. The size and steep slope of the mountain is the perfect breeding ground for some of the largest avalanches ever seen. You may be wondering what it's like to actually be in an avalanche. Well, this next skier has some first-hand experience. <laughs> It was a beautiful day on Mount Verbier in Switzerland. A group of friends are out skiing the slopes after a large snowfall the night before. With about two feet of new snow powder, the avalanche danger rating on this day was listed as considerably high. Suddenly, the snow gives way, and the skier goes along for a short ride before coming to a stop. It seems like the danger is over, but the avalanche is actually just beginning. A massive ice sheet has separated a couple hundred feet above, and it's careening directly towards the downed skier. He gets hit hard and buried underneath the snow. Several minutes pass before his friends successfully dig him out. Had he been in there for much longer, it's possible he could have suffocated. The avalanche this skier created started small, but would later grow into one of the largest avalanches on this region of Mount Verbier. Telluride is a ski town located in Colorado. Every year, they set off controlled avalanches to help protect life and property. The peak of this mountain usually accumulates significant amounts of snowfall, making the mountain unstable. By setting off a controlled avalanche, they can remove the unstable snow and ensure no one is in harm's way if a natural avalanche occurs. This year, the controlled avalanche was considerably larger than anyone expected. In fact, the avalanche almost reached the town, as you can see. That's a little too close for comfort. What we're about to see is one of the largest ever controlled avalanches. Take a look. The BC Department of Transportation sets off a controlled avalanche over Highway 1. In the days prior, significant amounts of snowfall had accumulated on the mountain above the highway. They were worried an avalanche could naturally form, which may have taken out cars on the highway. To prevent this, they stopped all traffic and set it off themselves. And the subsequent avalanche is one of the largest ever seen in British Columbia.
Check out my previous video right here, and don't forget to subscribe for more Top 5 videos.